Watching here, Cap? No, you're not kidding. Uh, you know, it's going to be a wild ride for the next 24 hours. Now, we, we have a light mix here in Albany, so we may not get much more additional snow here. But to the north, uh, we still have some snow. Here's the view up at Tinney's Tavern, higher elevation of northwest Saratoga County at Lake Desolation. The snow is coming down at a pretty good clip. These areas may get a few inches of snow before it even changes over in those locations. Now, let's break this down. A lot to talk about. Winter weather advisories for snow or mixed precip, Adirondacks, Catskills, Helderbergs, Berkshires, and Southern Vermont. Now, snowfall from the first part of the storm, we may have to cut down the accumulations to the south because it looks like that warmer air is pushing uh, quicker to the north. Not much more here. There may be a half inch or an inch or so off to the north. Northwest of Lake George, notice one to three, and then three to six for the Adirondacks. Helderbergs back along I-88, northern Catskills, one to three, one to three northern Berkshires, higher elevations of the southern Green Mountains, three to six inches of snow. High wind warnings in effect, wind advisories in effect. Those are the light tan. Uh, winds after midnight tonight, tomorrow morning in particular, gusting 40 to 50 miles per hour here, 50 to 60 miles per hour, Adirondacks, higher elevations of the Taconics, and the higher elevations of uh, western New England. Uh, here's the future cast winds tomorrow morning at about 9 o'clock based on our computer models. 40 to 50 mile per hour wind gusts from the south and southeast. They could be as high as 50 to 60, especially the higher elevations of the northern Berkshires and southern Green Mountains. Flood watch in effect late tonight, tomorrow in particular. Rain, some of the rain will be heavy, melting snow because of the warm temperatures. So runoff, so we'll keep an eye on that. Some of the rivers and streams will uh, be on the rise. Rainfall, one to one and a half inches of rain likely here, but notice Western New England, 1.7 at Bennington to 2.2 at Pittsfield. Temps right now close to freezing with the exception of Bennington a little bit warmer around North Adams. Great Barrington above freezing at uh, 35. Weather watchers tonight, 28 at Indian Lake. A little light snow, Queensbury, Whitehall, Hebron at 31. Light snow about an inch or so out towards Caroga Lake and Gloversville and Dwaynesburg. 32 at Greenfield Center. Del Mar, low 30s around Adams from Greg Trottier, 32 light snow in Lanesboro uh, tonight. Light snow in Summit, changing the rain now in Wyndham, and light rain Germantown to Hillsdale with temperatures in the uh, mid 50s. So again, this is the mix. This is the rain. It's all moving northward and mostly snow as you head up uh, north of uh, Saratoga Springs. Part one tonight is this storm. Part two is the, the Arctic cold front to the west of us tomorrow afternoon, followed by part three, and that's the Arctic blast by tomorrow evening. All right, future cast, the rain pushes northward tonight. Here's the Arctic front. When it goes by, a quick burst of snow is possible for an hour or two tomorrow afternoon. That may give us a coating to an inch. Some of the outlying areas may get an inch or two of snow from that. Starting out at 53 tomorrow morning. Look how warm it is tomorrow morning. Upper 40s to low 50s. By 6 o'clock, 20 in Albany, 12 at Lake Pleasant, 19 in Hudson. Everything freezes over. Wind chills Saturday morning. This is the way it's going to feel, the wind chills. 10 to 15 below. 25 below or colder for parts of the Adirondacks. All right, tonight snow mixed to rain. Late tonight, temperatures rise and the winds increase. For tomorrow, a morning high of 53, rain and wind, brief burst of snow. Then the temperatures tumble in the afternoon. Mostly cloudy, windy over the holiday weekend. 18 Christmas Eve, 24 Christmas Day, wind chill sub zero. Quiet on Monday, 28, not bad Tuesday, near 30. Snow flurries Wednesday, and then by Thursday, partly sunny, a high of 38. John?